Lisa Stoppe is excited to be kicking off her 10th anniversary Smile Cookie Week as co-owner at the Brant Street Tim Hortons. This program is near and dear to our hearts here at Tim Hortons. Every location, the staff gets so excited. Our customers love this program. They know about it. They expect it. They look forward to it. Um, we have competitions between stores, actually, where the staff try to sell the most cookies possible. And it's a really fun, just a fun, friendly competition that we have going on. So it's really exciting. We want to do better than last year every year. Last year, $81,000 was raised for the Burlington Food Bank. Proceeds from this year's Smile Cookie campaign in Burlington will go to the food bank again. And really, there's no better time that people really need with the high prices and the difficult times we've had over the last couple of years. We're able to feed more people than ever and we need to come together as a community in these difficult times. Smile Cookie Week is just an incredible time for us at the food bank. It's the time of year that we see the most fundraising happen for us. Uh, we really don't have any fundraiser that comes close to what we raise through Smile Cookie Week. And it allows us to really serve the community, uh, those who are going without food, um, with really good, healthy, nutritious food. I think a lot of people have um, heard a lot of the stories about inflation. They've seen it in the grocery store, they've seen it at the gas pumps. But they've also gone through a lot of their savings and every other means that they've had as a bit of a social safety net they're running out of. And so uh, we're usually the last place that people want to go to. Um, and now they're finding themselves coming to the food bank. In fact, the Burlington Food Bank served more people in August of 2022 than during any month in the first years of the pandemic. So even in 2020 and 2021, times where we thought that we would have been hitting our peak, uh, we're actually seeing those numbers increasing right now. Smile cookies are available for first years, and again, all the sales are going to the Smile Cookie program. Um, we also have these badges for sale this year. It's new. Uh, there's different funny faces. Some of the cookies turn a little bit different, so it's kind of fun. Small Cookie program began in 1996, and since the program's inception, actually 77, over $77 million have been raised for local charities and organizations, which is amazing. So great to be a part of. First Smile Cookie ever. Reporting for Halton News, I'm Nikki Wesley.